Hey everybody, today we're taking a look at this new soldering iron kit that I recently got. Let's open it up and check it out. So this is everything in the box. We've got a set of tweezers, some solder, a spool holder, because this will be able to mount on the back, a little solder sucker right here in case you need to remove and repair anything. Then we have the solder gun included with a couple additional tips. So this is a 60 watt soldering iron, simple on off operation right here on the very top. If you ever need to change out any of the tips here, just release right here. It's pretty standard for uh, a soldering iron. And then the thing that separates it here is we've got a trigger right here. So we're gonna be able to put the spool of solder, feed it through, and as you pull the trigger, it's gonna push it through right up onto the iron. So you can do this with one-handed operation and use your other free hand to hold your wire, electronics, or whatever it is, it is that you're doing to solder. So you just load the solder onto the spool and that slides right over here as a little bracket back there that's gonna hold it. Then we're gonna be able to feed the solder through the little cone underneath here. And what you'll see if you take the side cover off is that you feed it in through the back, it's gonna start to go through these gears or a feeder, and as you pull the trigger, it's gonna feed it forward and then out of the front tube. So I start to slide the solder in until it stops, and then I can start to press the trigger. And right there, it's gonna start to feed it and watch it come out the front. And there we go, and now it's coming out the front, and now we're just gonna line it up and get it to hit the tip perfectly. Now if you ever need to remove the solder, don't yank on it because it's being held in there. So what you wanna do is hold the trigger down all the way, give it a nice snug grip, and then you'll be able to pull out any of the excess solder nice and easy, and it's not gonna break on you. This door is also great in case there's any complications, maybe there's a jam, maybe the solder breaks, you'll be able to open this up and fish that piece out and then start over like new. So once you get it hot and ready, it's really easy to use. Just put the tip right where you want it, start to pull the trigger, it feeds the solder out, and it's real nice and convenient. And whether you're working on circuit boards or just tending up some wires, makes it real easy to do that with the free hand. At the end of the day, it's a good little soldering iron and it's really easy and straightforward to use. Simple on-off operation, feed your solder through, pull the trigger, and you're ready to go.